So today we will talk about Adobe Admin Console. Adobe Admin Console is provided to all enterprise organizations wherein they can manage their licenses, they can check their purchase history, they can see what applications they have under their enterprise agreement. Also they can add users, they can create packages, they can also talk to Adobe support. Admin Console is one stop shop where you can manage everything for your enterprise organization. So for going to Ad Adobe Admin Console, you have to go to adminconsole.adobe.com and sign in with your Adobe ID and password. So it will take you to the Adobe Admin Console and this is the first page uh, where you will land in the Overview tab. So the Overview tab displays the summary of licenses that you have purchased under your enterprise agreement. And it also displays the amount of storage that you have with this, each plan. So in this case, uh, we have Adobe Stock that is for 2 GB and it is for higher education. We have Adobe Spark K12 that is also 2 GB. We have all apps plan that is 80 GB and we have shared device. So it depends upon the product and the licenses, what you have in your organization, you will see the same in the overview tab. Over here, uh, there is an option to export to a CSV. So whatever you have in the overview tab, all these plans, it can be exported to the CSV format if you want to share it with someone else. And over here in the dropdown, it's just showing us Creative Cloud. If you have Document Cloud as well in this or Marketing Cloud. So accordingly, it will show you uh, all the products in the dropdown. So over here in the console, uh, we only have Creative Cloud. So it's just giving us the option to choose Creative Cloud. So the other quick links we can see add user to an organization. So you can directly add the user to your organization. You can add an admin to your organization and give him admin rights according to your requirements. And over here, it's the name of the admin console. And if you are an admin for multiple organization, you will have admin rights for multiple consoles. So then you can just click on the name and it will give you the name of other consoles as well in the drop down list. So the next option is the help option. So if you click on that, you will see some tutorials for the admin console, how to get started. Uh, over here, you can browse for these tutorials and there are some product tutorials as well. You can search over here, whatever you want to look for. And there's a community forum. And if you click on that, it will take you to community.adobe.com and it will land you to enterprise forums wherein you can just post your query and someone from the enterprise support uh, will connect with you. You can start a chat as well with the support agent and you can share your feedback. This is the notification tab. If Adobe has to notify something, you will see the notifications over here. This is a status tab means uh, you can go to status.adobe.com. It will give you the information on uh, the services and the processes that we have with Adobe and if there is any maintenance going on right now. And this tab will give you your account information like the email address and the user that you have logged in on the admin console. So this is all about the overview tab. Hope you, hope you understand that.